It's like easy money, like chicken dinner. <laughs> Finger looking good. The combos that he can hit on Squirtle, I mean on Falcon is insane. Absolutely. Captain Falcon, great ground speed. Guess what? Squirtle's got amazing ground speed. Right. Captain Falcon has solid aerials. Guess what? Squirtle's not only got great aerials, but also better air acceleration than you do. And then you have Hydro Pump on top of it. Like, oh, you want to go high? Okay. Like, let's just... Let me just push you off. But. Absolutely. Yeah, we're going to see a lot of dancing. This is great. This is what you want to see out of high-level gameplay. Dance, dance, dance. Uh, and see what the opponent's going to do. Yeah, and they're both definitely off. aware of, like, the first hit is going to take, like, 40%. <laughs> um, this is just raw neutral right now. But here we go. And that's Rapid. probably Falcon's own. Oh, interesting. I, I like it, though. I like it, though. I like the thought there yeah. that there was going to be a platform tech in the shield. But, uh, no, great great for, for Noodle to just play patient. And also because Squirtle is, like, a little hard to combo, too, just because of his height and his size. Or the same thing, I guess. But no, I've, you're height and weight is more accurate of me to say. Definitely. I expect to see Noodle stick on Squirtle for at least until probably oh, about 70%. I, just, I think just missing the backer there. And yeah, I don't know what Falcon can do about that pressure. No. And especially back out of shield. Um, it does so much. It creates such a good position for Noodle to be in. Because Falcon, you know, Falcon at ledge, he's, he's okay, but Squirtle ledge trapping, just PT ledge trapping in general is insane. Absolutely. But the one thing that Jennifer's got going is high damaging yeah. abilities. And switching to Ivestar is going to be tough. Yeah, this is where Jennifer really needs to make their money. This Absolutely. is where the matchup becomes pretty doable. And if you're already forced off a of Squirtle and you're still in the lead, that's that's a good look for the game. Yeah, you had no choice but to switch off a of Squirtle at that high percentage because any stray hit could kill you. And even though you're small, you don't want to take that risk against Falcon. Oh, wow. Going high, but yeah, getting the sour spot up down there, thankfully. Smart on Jennifer to save the jump there for that as well. Uh, but we got some juggle situation. Great air dodge. Yeah, and that's where also Ivysaur, I don't think, is like too. It's, Ivysaur definitely can do some stuff against Falcon. But Falcon's airspeed and Falcon's just mobility in the air can just kind of evade most of Ivysaur's juggles. Like, fastfall air dodge is super good at Falcon, and Ivysaur has to hard commit to catch that. So. This is definitely a volatile place to be in if you're Noodle because you need to get the advantage or you're going to be in a tough spot because Ivysaur's disadvantage is rough. Yeah, and I'm surprised that Charizard isn't coming out. There, there it, is. it is. Yeah, I was going to say now is like the time for Charizard because Ivysaur almost died a couple times. Charizard's heavier. If you were Ivysaur getting hit by that dash attack, you were dead. Oh, so great switch. Forward Ooh. smash. That was a crazy one. You had choices to punish yeah. the Falcon dive missing there. Uh, the Not only did you have obviously the ending lag, but the landing lag. So That is confidence right there to go for a forward smash, but good catch. And now Noodle has to switch. Um, unless, oh yeah, now you just switch. Yep. Yeah, can we talk about that, by the way? What a choice. You, you know, Noodle's on Squirtle, and you still choose to Falcon dive yeah. in his face. That's, like, high likelihood that that's going to miss, but great choice. And I think it's called also the fact that Noodle was caught switching, and your instinct when you're, you know, because you're pretty much, like, vulnerable when you switch, your first instinct is shield. And will this Falcon dive cover shield? Right. So good recognition on Jennifer there. Definitely showing some match for, matchup expertise. Definitely. Oh, run up shield twice in a row. We'll have to see it. Yeah, trying to play patient. It is the second stock. Oh, oh. yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Fantastic yep, yep. choice. Definitely choose nothing else. Cho choose the yeah. move that's going to hit both sides. Yes. Here. Don't even mess with it. Don't even try to forward smash like Noodle did earlier. He saw that the waterfall misled, and he's just like, you know what? Yeah, I'm just My gonna, legs out. Yep. Here we go. This is huge. Like, caught on. Yeah, I switching. wanted to see Jennifer kind of catch that read because there wasn't really an option for, for Noodle there. Yeah, you did not want to be a Charizard at 37%, but now you're 65% on Squirtle, and you've got to hold this advantage. Oh, yeah, and right there, I think you just kind of wait. Okay, or you, that's or you fine. Spike. Yeah, you can, just, <laughs> you can just do that too. Uh, I don't know what I'm talking about. Yeah, no, no the down air is ledge trap on me. Oh, what? Choice. Jennifer a little robbed there, if I'm being honest. Part of what makes the matchup tough is that Captain Falcon doesn't have a lot of choices mm -hmm. to recover, like, high. Especially against Ivysaur, you're just going to get... A you're just gonna down it every single time. And if yeah. you go high, like, okay, well, now you're at ledge. Great. So have fun. And Ivysaur has like a million things to cover highs. So. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I, honestly, the Ivysaur has been putting a lot of work in this set. More so than Squirtle, which is surprising, but every PC man has their comfort character. That was tight. Uh, that was a, also great awareness on Jennifer using the Nair yeah. 1, but choosing not to go for a riskier confirm that you might not get and just wait for the option because Noodle's going to have yeah. a defensive option in hand. There's I mean, no you're scared, yeah. You're, you got hit by Nair 1 Falcon when you're at like 100%. You're going to die, so you have to choose something. And uh, it was just smart on Jennifer to say, let me not off. take the risk. Let me just do the safe thing. Yeah, do the safe thing. And I, I just like Jennifer's just playing confident. If you're playing Falcon, you have to be playing confident. And that's kind of like obvious to admit. But mm. when you see it being really reflected in the play game one, I think that you're in a, you're in a good place. Absolutely. 
not a lot of Falcon players in Georgia, barring fatality. Yeah. So I don't know how much uh, matchup knowledge Noodle has in this one, but I'm assuming Jennifer has a little bit more PT matchup knowledge. Definitely. I mean, I know C Stream used to play in NC. That's one of them. You, have, you still have Stain in, um, in Georgia too, also mm. for Falcon. True. But I, I, I don't think matchup experience is like too as big of a deal in this um, matchup as it is like maybe I don't know Corn Kirby as it was. Right. But I think these two just need to, especially Noodle, just needs to really clean up his punish game. I feel like a lot of times he's getting the hit, but like right there, not really just getting much off of it. What's the annotation? Oh. It's cleaning up the punish game. Let's hear it. Yeah, it, it, I think it's just cleaning up the punish game and more confidence. I, I think Noodle has like an idea of what Jennifer is gonna do, but isn't like fully like committed to pressing the like the button yet. Are you oh, dead? Down air into up smash, not taking it. Oh, interesting little platform. Got, got kind of stuck there. All right, disadvantage Falcon on the ledge. Oh, got back yeah, to stage. Th that was just yeah, great flow chart right there. Um, just covered everything really, but. Yeah, and that's that's the confidence I'm talking about. Just being able to like scout out that roll like all the way. Measured confidence, absolutely. Yeah. This is tight. This yeah. is going to be the first stock is going to be big momentum. Definitely, because if, if Noodle takes his first stock, you can switch a Squirtle, get like a bread and butter 60% combo, then switch off and just kind of chill with Charizard. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> if you're Noodle and you lose the stock, though, you're back on Squirtle and you're Which trying is, to kill yeah. at 157. Yeah, yeah. You're looking for a grab, probably. Oh, yeah, you're crazy. Wow. Went for a really hard, I think, roll-in read, if I had to guess, with that up smash, but gets punished for it. Jennifer's punish game, 100% on point. You know, I was talking about confidence, but I mean, this is just confidence and charging up smash in the middle. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, I call that one an ego charge. Yeah. Oh, yeah, down throw. It kills. Interesting. I think any of them would have probably uh, killed at that point. 200%. Okay. I don't know. Why the delayed switch there, do you think? I'm not sure. I, I assume just to try to not get punished for switching. But he took, like, 40%. I don't know. I yeah. think he was just, like... In his head, he was like, okay, I can play Ivy Storm. And then he thought about it. He's like, wait, why am I going to do that when I can just do this? Yeah. Easy 47. Up B. Okay. Oh, yeah. I like the, I like the decision for the, the back there. Yeah. Oh. Back to yeah, the Raptor boost is the only way that you have an option to, to recover high. And if you use it sparingly enough, you're in a good spot. Great yeah. Falcon down. Because that was like the first Raptor boost. Jennifer used to recover all set. So Noodle definitely just wasn't ready for the option. And when, even though they had time to react, Kind of forgot about the platform. Absolutely. Now you're trying to hold your advantage with your Ivysaur here, but the second that Falcon gets a little bit of I footing, like I like that. I like that. I like the decision to go for that. But Jennifer just kind of stank and chill. No switch to Charizard there means that the backer is going to take the stock. And now we're at uh, last stock for winner side if you're Noodle. I'm glad that at least that Noodle hasn't really gone for those Ivysaur forward smash that ledge. Because if you're Falcon too, especially, you get a lot of your combos from, you know, aerial starters. So, if, and Jennifer is going to be wanting to jump from ledge, and that's the one thing that beats Ivysaur F Smash from ledge. You know, just, just smart on Noodle. It's really tough to play Ivysaur in this match if you don't have a lot of yeah. options to use Razor Leaf to space. So, you kind of have to choose, am I going to play Squirtle or am I going to play Charizard? And playing Charizard, you just have a lot of worse options than Captain Falcon does yeah. in the same situation. But I, back air spacing is a great choice. Yeah, I want to, I kind of want to see Noodle mash more. Um, PT, especially with Ivysaur and mainly Squirtle, has the luxury of just keeping hitboxes out at all times. And if Falcon is trying to rush in, and ooh, if Falcon is trying to rush in against Squirtle, who keeps back airing and doing other stuff like Nair, it's it's pretty hard for Falcon to get going. But I mean, I'm talking about Noodle when Jennifer's just kind of putting on a show right now. And yeah. I just need to stop talking sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> it's the caster's curse. Yeah, it really is. Commentator's curse. So now we're at the last stock. You have to stay. Yeah, yeah Man, I, switch I, back to Squirtle is definitely risky. I, I like the risk though because right there was an easy punish. Um, not really easy, but that was a grab. Absolutely. Yeah, going for that Here's classic where you, like, 10 grab. Kind punish. of switch off. Oh man, I'm really holding my breath here because any stray hit putting Squirtle in disadvantage, yeah. you're gonna what? Switch to Ivysaur? Okay, oh, great. I, oh, the air dodge, spot dodge, classic. Got the Nair, trying to stay around, trying to keep stage pressure, trying not to get hit. And Noodle is trying to go for this game of, of like stuffing out with back air and fair kind of preemptively, which I think is what Noodle should be doing, but just barely missing. I think doing it a little too early. And so Jennifer is able to just like go after the fact. Like right there, that was exactly kind of what I'm talking about. Just throw it out. Absolutely. We're getting down to the wire with this. They're both at kill percentages depending on what the combo That's huge. is. huge, yep. Sour spot. Oh, oh my gosh, you had that. Is that it? Okay. I don't even know how to commentate I think, this. I think you switched to Charizard right here. 
You don't want to risk dying to something like stupid. Yeah, you have to switch to Charizard here. Up smash to Charizard will kill as well. You need to find a time to switch. Yeah, that's the challenge. Um, because if you oh, you might be up throw, almost killing. Yeah, no, switch. switch. Oh, we got it. We got to see something. He wants to recover safely. Just, yeah. If you're, I mean, playing against Falcon. Yeah. What are your choices? Yeah. Dash attack's gonna kill though. Wouldn't have killed Charizard. I'll tell you that. That's what I'm saying. Um, I think. But, like I said, every PC has their comfort character, mm. and Ivysaur, I think, was proving to be neutral.